And we know the Catholic Church, even the church member, and as you say now, Iskon also has a sinful relationship with a disciple. He's not cast out. He's not automatically disqualified. He just has to pay some money or pay some, do some penance or just say, I'm sorry, or something like that. And then he can go on being a bogus guru all, all, all over again. Right. Mm -hmm. But the main point is, and I'm going to focus on this, and we've made the point a million times in this conversation, this one, but I want to say it again. The term insufficient guidance means not Uttama Adhikari. Let that be planted, carved in stone with a diamond chisel. Uttama Adhikari is sufficient guidance. Madhyam and Kanista Adhikari is insufficient guidance. And if they do, if, if they do not do that, Prabhupada says, however, one should not imitate the behavior of an advanced devotee or Mahabhagavat without being self-realized. For by such imitation, one will eventually become degraded. Yeah, he will. And then like these gurus go into big kirtans and they do like the do it rock concerts where the people float them over the crowd and they go spinning around over the crowd hand to hand. What has that got to do with Lord Chaitanya or Vaishnavism? Yeah, very clear that nectar of instruction, verse five, you know, every guru should read to their disciple and disciples should ask, are you a Uta Madhakari devotee situated in your rasa with Krishna? Perfectly knowing Krishna, you can see him face to face. If they say no, then <laughs> move on to the next guy. <laughs> yeah, but now may I, and also, if they want to say, well, Prabhupada is the actual guru, I'm the Shiksha guru. In one place, in some of his writing, you can look it up in the Veda base. Prabhupada said the Diksha guru and the Shiksha guru must be on the same platform. Otherwise, one or both of them is bogus. Right, right. Those are basically right. uh, either yes. it's or close to it. Diksha so, guru and Shiksha guru, Prabhu? Yeah, so both of them. Guru, you could say, well, I'm the Shiksha guru and Prabhupada is the Diksha guru. Well, no. If you're not on the same platform as Prabhupada, you cannot become Shiksha Guru. Can't we have multiple Shiksha Gurus? Shiksha Gurus? Because if you are the same on the, if you are not on the same as the level of the actual Guru, then one or both are bogus. 